gentleman had contacted me about making an intake manifold flange for him. He's making his own manifold, but he wanted me to make the carburetor side so that he wouldn't have to do that himself. So that's what we're making here. We just finished drilling the holes. Now we're going to cut out the bores. These are for Weber's DCOEs, the side drafts that they make. We get all four bores cut out. We'll put some uh, WD-40 on it and go back and do the finish pass. I found that gives me a pretty good surface. Now we're doing a recess here so that the intake runners can recess into the flange itself. It was right about here that I noticed that the depth was not right. I wanted it to go halfway through the flange and it was only a quarter way. So I had to go back and cut that over again. Once we get all four of those cut, spray it down again, do the finish pass. And then I take it and bolt it to a fixture plate to cut the outside perimeter. This plate was actually intended for something else, which is why you see the odd clamping on the right side there. It wasn't made for this. I've been doing some research, uh, and it looks like I've been babying this machine. I think I can take a much deeper cut, get more use out of the full cutting surface of the end mill. I've just kind of gotten into the habit of doing a shallow cut and chasing the outline multiple times. But I think I'm going to do a little more research and some test cuts to get more use out of that cutter. And here we go with the finish pass. Now I intended to show you the process for doing the tapping, but uh, I got some something splashed up on the lens there and I didn't catch it. But uh, here you, you have to use your imagination a little bit. The tapping head is great. If you ever plan on tapping more than one hole in your life, I recommend getting yourself a tapping head for your drill press. And here it is, final product. Put it on the belt sander, cleaned it up a little, deburred the edges. Now she's ready to be boxed up and sent off. So that's it. Thanks for watching.